Welcome back everybody. Today we're gonna do a quick fajita recipe. From start to finish, it's only about 10 minutes. It's on a gas grill and we'll get that grill fired up and bring you right back. Stay tuned. Welcome back. Today we're just gonna do a quick and easy fajita cook. We have some Angus beef skirt steak got from Kroger on sale, uh, usually about eight bucks a pound. They had it on sale for $5.99 a pound, so we got a little bit of it. Just gonna go, and, and what I like to do with this is, the fat usually renders pretty good, but there are some hard chunks. Just feel around on this piece of skirt steak, and you'll feel that hard chunk. Just kinda trim some of that off. That's the way I prefer it, and that, and that way you don't have a grisly fat when you do cut it up for fajitas. You can feel it. I mean, you got the soft fat here, which is fine, and then you got the hard fat here. Just cut that out of there. And that's really all, all the trimming that you gotta do with these, is get that hard fat cut off. Just like a, on a brisket, the hard fat just doesn't render quite right. You get it cut off and you have better, better results at the end. So we'll get that cut off. I just like to check both sides of it, make sure we got we can off of it. The rest of that feels pretty good, so we'll leave it. There's a chunk there. And we'll check both sides here. Cut that. I like to get, get as much of that chunk of fat off as you can. If you like that stuff, then leave. If you don't like it, cut it like I do. It'll be a lot leaner when you when you go to eat it. The front side usually doesn't have a whole lot. It's usually that back side on that skirt stick that has the, the harder chunks of fat. The rest of the stuff will, will render quite well. So we're gonna go with that. So what we're using today is meat church fajita season. I've used a lot of fajita season, but I really, really like this one. This is what we're gonna use today. It's readily available in most, most stores out there or online. Uh, we even got a link to it in our, our description down, down below. You can pick it up from Amazon, but that's what we're gonna use on this. The kid likes it, the wife likes it. That's what we're going with. Put a pretty liberal coat on there. Pat it in a little bit, back side as well. And then we'll let this sit here for a minute and sweat. Absorb that rub and then we'll get it out to the grill. Gonna warm the grill up, medium, medium to high heat uh, with the lid closed and then uh, We'll throw this thing on there. Probably gonna take, looking at the thickness of this one, maybe about three minutes, three and a half minutes per side, and then we'll check the temperature. Want it to be about between 135 and 140 degrees to give it that medium rare to medium cook temperature. So we'll, we'll get that going and uh, we'll meet you guys out at the grill. So we got the pit up to temp. We're just gonna throw this skirt stick on. There. We're just going to not touch it for about three to three and a half minutes and then we'll give it a flip. All right, it's been on there about three minutes. Give her a, give her a flip. See y'all back in about three more minutes. All right, it's been about another three and a half minutes. Looks like our internal temperature, a little lower shot there, about 140, 142. Get that pulled off and we'll get a sliced up.
Those are going to be great. We'll cut them up and show you what they look like. All right, let's cut into this thing and see how it looks. Oh, yeah. That looks great. Still juicy. A little bit more done than what we were shooting for, but it's perfect. It'll work. We'll just cut these things up. We'll take a bite of this. Oh yeah, that season is perfect. It's good salt, a little bit of kick. Man, you can't do, do better than this. 10 minutes, in and out, three on each side, about three and a half on, on the other side. Guys, a 10 minute meal, you can cut this up, throw it into some tortillas, and you got yourself a meal. Come back and see us.